Amzansi, the battle between Musa Kola and Mushandiki started on Twitter, moved to hands being thrown and it seems has gone back to the streets where it started on. From speculation that Ndiki was fired earlier this week to Musa Kola gloating, it seemed that Ndiki might be seeing flames on the professional front. But if there's one king of clapbacks, Mzansi, it has to go to Mushandiki. Hey, hey, Mzansi. Hello and welcome to entertainment news Mzansi. if you're new to my channel you know you have all the stories go ahead click the subscribe button and of course the bell and you'll never miss an update now Mzansi, in a series of tweets mushandiki made it clear that not only was he not fired but he is still getting more bags than one by now we should all know that stories by musa kaula must be taken with a grain of salt now this is a while he sometimes has quality tea and gossip some of his stories are direct cut and paste unsupported rumors which are based on pushing numbers rather than telling facts therefore when it was rumored that mushandiki was fired from gomorrah due to his nightclub bro with kaula in august kaula was only too happy to take to the to the streets to gloat and suggest that his petition to get Ndiki fired from gomorrah was the reason he was given the boot from the show he posted Moshe Ndiki has been fired from Gomorrah. Gomorrah felt Moshe was bringing their name into disrepute after he attacked Musa Kaula at White Lounge. I'd also like to thank each and every one of you who signed my petition, which led to Moshe getting fired. Checkmate, bitch. However, now it seems that Ndiki waited a few days to let Musa Kaula to think that he has won the entire chess game, only to make it clear that besides being hands-on when dealing with a troll, Ndiki has proved that he can also be petty as fuck when given the chance. Now, saying to Twitter recently, his first post made it clear that he was still earning that Gomorrah bag as he posed up with his fellow cast members as they got their makeup ready for a day of shooting. <laughs> What is the date today? It's the majority. What is the date today? It's the date today. 16th September 2022. What is the day? Not the date. Friday. Now, yikes, Mzansi. Now, to drive the point across, Ndiki returned with another clapback video where he showed off his moves dancing to Beyonce's partition. The caption made it clear to everyone that that was Team Kaula that they might have signed the petition. But similar to the one signed by all Mithalinda Masa haters, the petition did not work. But who thought it would, anyways? <laughs> And uh, that is how you clear a bitch. Now, the rest of the time, Dickie spent it thanking his followers for welcoming him to Pettyville, a place where all the pettiness lives and spends their free time making sure they are on the necks of their favorite trolls. Now, it just so happens that Ndiki happens to be Musa Akaula. Now, Mzansi, in order to drive the final nail in the Musa Akaula coffin, Ndiki not only made it clear that his job at Gomorrah is still safe, but he also went on to make 
make it clear that he is still as booked and busy as ever. His last post showed him catching flights and not feelings. His caption made it clear that he is grateful for his fan base support and that anyone who thinks that Kolo is going to be the cause of his downfall is truly mistaken and uh, stupid. All we can say, Mzansi, is that I love the drama. Hopefully, the two will continue the social media back and forth. And who knows, maybe we will get to see the two eventually throw hands during one of the Kaspanyovas' celebrity boxing match. Now, there you have it, Mzansi. Do leave your thoughts in the comment section. You know, I love to hear from you. And I want to hear, what do you guys think of this fiery clapback? But before you go... Please make sure you click on the face on the screen, which will take you to my new channel where you can please subscribe so I can get ready to bring you guys some awesome new content. And to all those who've already subscribed, you know I love you and I appreciate you. But for now, you know, I will bring you the updates hot just the way you like it.